y'all for tuning back in to your favorite channel, Pelican Bay Dog Talk and News for the day, for the night, for the evening, for the morning. I'm giving it to you the way I always do, fair and unbiased. Some gonna like it, some ain't, man. Some gonna like it, some ain't. Like I always say, y'all hit that like button. Y'all hit them comments up like you always do. Big shout out to all my brothers and sisters down in the chat right now. Big salute to all my brothers and sisters watching this video from afar and all Big salute to all the brothers and sisters, the dog lovers from one side of this country to the other side, from one side of this world to the other side. Big salute to you. Hope everybody had a great day taking care of them animals out there. It's your boy PBK9. Let's give you that dog talk, dog TV, dog news, the way I always do. Let's get into it for the day. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> we just got a little bit more dog talk to talk about, some reactions, you know, and, and some responses and all, you know, all that type of stuff. First, we're going to, you know, like I always say, let me make sure my brothers and sisters down there in the chat, though, you know what I'm saying? Let me make sure y'all brothers and sisters down there in the chat, because we got some things to talk about. We ain't going to be here too long today. You know um, you know how I get when I get to talking. Might be, you know, tell how long we get here, but we ain't going to be here too long, man. You know, just address some issues, you know, um, no problems, just some issues. We're going to address some issues. In this dog game, in this dog community, in these swamps, you know, in these swamps. Once you once you stir the swamps up, man, them swamps, you start seeing all kind of stuff that come out that water, you know. And that's what this is. That's all the stuff that's coming out in them swamps when you stir it up. You no, know, you can leave that swamp still, and you won't even know what's up what's up under that murky, muddy looking water. But the moment you go messing with it, ain't no telling what's sitting up under there. You know, that's what's going on now. All the fungus, all the, everything that's up under that swamp water is making it, making themselves be known. You know, making themselves be known. Big Stepper. That's what they call you on that side. We don't call you that on this, on this side, Big Stepper. You know, because <laughs> you ain't no Big Stepper on this side. You know, and the boys in California, they say you's an Arizona dude. You ain't no California dude. The boys say you from Arizona. Fronting like you from trying to talk California, you know. But it is what it is, man. Big Stepper, the fake Crip, the only person to keep talking about Crip, Crip, Crip amongst a bunch of civilians. You know, we all civilians, Ram. Walk them down. What you walking down? Walk them down, fat boy. You know. <laughs> hey, man, y'all boys always cracking at me, cracking on me because I'm skinny. But damn, all y'all fat, you know. <laughs> Who said that was the American way? Just to grow up and be fat. You know what I'm saying? Who want to grow up and be healthy? You know, it is what it is, man. But walk them down. You got to stop all that fake cripping and all that stuff like that, man. You ain't putting no work in in them crips. You ain't putting no dog work in, and you ain't putting no crip work in. You know? You ain't putting no crip work in, you ain't putting no dog work in. I be down. Big stepper. 50-something-year-old man <laughs> keep screaming he a crip. And he ain't even from Cali. And he talking about the bay. Talking about the bay, y'all. Talking about the bay. Posting my old news articles up. <laughs> boy, y'all boys, hey, y'all ever notice every time somebody needs some kicks, they go, go to my old news articles. Man, I wrote a book about them news articles. Go back and check the book on Amazon. Black Spielberg. Kilos and palm trees. Yep. And see when I publish that. And matter of fact, with y'all with y'all pocket watchers and all y'all haters, what y'all do, go on Amazon and look up Black Spielberg and look up the, the, the print date on each one of them books so you know that they ain't just been printed yesterday or the day before. I've been wrote them books. Been wrote them. But it is what it is. We ain't talking about right, that right now. We talking about this fake, fake crib we got out here. You know what I'm saying? Big stepper. Big stepper. Ain't never stepped towards nothing. <laughs> At least that's what them Cali boys say. You know, these are, I, I'm from South Carolina, so I don't know what you're stepping to. Them, them Cali boys say you ain't stepping to shit. And they say they don't do YouTube. But they say you ain't stepping. And then you want to go get my news article. Come on, Ram. You get mad because I say you was a semen recruit, Ram. Ram, you get mad because I wouldn't let you on the show last night because you ain't had enough credentials. Is that is that why you mad, homie? Because I would let you on the show if I knew it was going to make you that mad. 
You know what I'm saying? But I was just trying to be honest with you, fam. Everybody that was up there had stripes. At least claimed they had stripes, so that's what we was going to see. We was going to see, did they deserve their stripes? If they didn't, we was going to strip them. That's why I believe it was so hard for brothers to show up. When I, when, I, when I called for Thompson and I called for Buck City and Welsh, that's why I believe it was so hard for them to show up. They sent the flunkies. They sent the semen recruits. You know? But hey, man, it is what it is. You know, um, Ram, Ram just ain't, you know, you just ain't qualified for battle when it comes to any of this type of stuff, man. You know? And then the first thing you go running to about, listen, listen here, man. That's what's wrong with y'all boys. We out here talking about dogs, and y'all running like a chicken, like a chicken with the head cut off, talking about, oh, I'm gonna run it, I'm gonna post this, I'm gonna post that. Post me a damn dog that you got, Ram. A good damn dog. You wanna post something? Y'all, y'all talking about and wanna post everything, but <laughs> what's somebody to ask you for? Now I understand. I'm starting to see Ram why you don't got no page. You ain't made for it, homie. Like I said last night, you is an ad lib, a background, you know? You's a background singer. So I don't expect you to get a page. But it is what it is, though, dog. It is what it is. You got to stop all that faking amongst civilians, you know? Stop all that faking amongst folk who don't believe you ain't stepping to nothing. You know, stop all that talk, because these folk, half the folk that I hear, the boys don't even like to hear you talk. They say you sound like you're afraid when you talk. They say, Ram, walk him down. The big stepper. <laughs> you big, but you ain't no stepper. You know, that's what it is. You big, but you ain't no stepper. And that name Ram, that, that fits you too, you know. That name Ram fits you too, but Stepper don't, Stepper just, you know, unless you was a Stepper in college. You know what I'm saying? You might have been the Stepper in college. That might have been your name from college. You know, it just so happened, brothers start using that lingo in modern day term. But you was the big Stepper in school. Not high school, but college, if you went to college. Other than that, you ain't Stepping to shit. You know what I'm saying? You're not Stepping to nothing. <laughs> we got some stuff to talk about. We got some stuff to break down today. You know what I'm saying? Because, hey, I know that wasn't enough for y'all. Y'all want me to go ahead and finish it on off. You know what I'm saying? Y'all want me to go ahead and finish it on off. I've been told y'all, you got cheetahs, rubbers. They like to rub their dogs. Take them to the, tell them, bring them to the square. They go to rubbing and they go to doing all that other stuff instead of showing up. Now, we're going to get into it. All I asked the brother was three different questions. Like three, simp one simple question. With three answers, I meant to say. Give me something about Michael Myers. And I'm going to get to that in a minute. You know, I'm going to get to that in a minute. I'm talking about something else right now. I'm about to move on from welcome, what his name is? Big Stepper. You know what I'm saying? I'm moving on from Big Stepper. But hey, man. What I do want to show y'all is the new chief in town. You know what I'm saying? Because we're going to talk about that old copper stuff with that hoe. I'm going to show y'all something. And we're going to dead this, hopefully, once again. I hope, hopefully, we can dead it once again because somebody done got, somebody done got uh, some old ass, where well, they got the same dog getting passed around from people to people. And now they got it. Everybody who get them tri dog, that, that set of tri color dogs that came off whole, they try to start that stuff back up again. And it's, uh, it's, it's one little, you know, one little. But right now, let me show you some real stuff right here, man. Let me show you some real stuff. You know, um, we got a new chief, like I said, J.D. Hogg. You know what I'm saying? J.D. Hogg. Red boy Jocko Bolio. Not too much really caring about that. You know what I'm saying? Not too much really caring about that. But what I am caring about, and see, this is why I'm seeing some of the hate is coming from, brothers. Would you know this dude Buck City is going around trying to get J.D. Hogg's little mates, sons, uh, off, um, Cousins and stuff like that. He's trying to buy the stuff that's coming down off J.D. Hall. He know he's a Michael Myers man. Why he not trying to recoup off that stuff that he had? Because he know it ain't shit, right? Or he know it ain't what it's supposed to be. Because if, I mean, hey, 
If I had just lost Sambo last year, I'd be damned if I wasn't trying to be going to get whatever offspring that somebody, some of these brothers got and all this other stuff. I wouldn't be out right here trying to look for J.D. Hogg stuff. That's why he's talking about J.D. Hogg. Now, what I'm going to do, my brothers, is I'm going to explain to y'all because some of y'all may not have caught on to what I was saying last night. Okay? This will happen. You know, my boy, City Boy Kennels bred his two dogs that he bought from Mall Cunt. He bought a, two dogs off Hogg. From all cunt. He bred them together. He got JD Hall. You know, okay. I got JD Hall from him, from City Boy. Okay. Now, off that, off that JD Hall litter, got brother Marcel got one, you know. And then you got Mall Cunt that got one. And now it's another one, it's a couple more that's out there. But you got Mall Cunt that got a female. And you got seven, eight that got one. Okay, now, Maul Cunt get rid of his. That's the one Buck City got now. Maul Cunt put the wrong, the wrong birthday on his, knowing what the birthday it is, because he got the first part right. He just ain't put the year right. He got a year, a whole year younger. And he know that dog is not 11 months. He know that dog is not a year. You see, that's what I was talking about. See, Buck City come on my channel last night talking about J.D. Hogg is 11 months. J.D. Hogg is going on two and a half years old, soon to be. I can't help because you and Maul Cut over there screwed up with whatever y'all got going on. You know what I'm saying? And, and the shit is coming back to bite y'all now. But when it come back to me with my dogs, I got to straighten it out. See, I wasn't going to say nothing at first. But when, when Maul Cut can't control his flunkies out there, you know, and then they get up on my channel talking about my dogs that I know this bred right. And, and Buck City don't got the right credentials with his. Obviously, if you got the wrong date talking about it's 11 months old. You know. Hey, Maul Cunt, 11 months ago, you should have been giving my boy, my kennel partner, you supposed to be giving my kennel partner a puppy off that female bred to a black male that you had off another whole kind of dog, right? You remember that, right, Maul Cut? You should remember that, right? That was damn near 11 months ago. So how can y'all get confused and say this same dog is barely even over, what, a year now? When you was trying to give my man a puppy off the dog that he gave you, he gave you the dog off the strength because you know he bought the dogs from you, so he gave you the dog off the strength. Now, you making a breeding with a black dog that's a whole total out. You tell my man, yo, I'm going to give you a puppy. <laughs> Maul Cunt, that was damn near 11 months ago. So how your flunky get up here and say the dog that you that he apparently got from you is, is a little over 11 months right now. And then you want to come up here and mess with a real dog, man. See, what we're going to do tonight, we're going to do a lot of comparing and contrasting. We're going to talk about these dogs. You know, like I say, Buck City admired that J.D. Hogg stuff. He's trying to get it. On the low, he's trying to get it. But what we're not going to do is not going to let you get it because the only way you can get that J.D. Hogg stuff, if you get it from me, no, because that's J.D. Hogg. All these other brothers, they got their own stuff. You know what I'm saying? And at the end of the day, <laughs> we got all the males on clinch. You and 7, 8 can share them females y'all got over there and breed them y'all ways. You know, we got our dogs. And you talk about them big John dogs, and you ain't never had none. You know what I'm saying? You ain't never had none. Everybody in your crew been bully men with the last 10 years ago. Everybody that's rolling with Buck City that I was talking shit about too in my chat last night, all been in the bully community in the last 10 years. Shout out to the real bully the community, them brothers who got bully dogs out there. You know what I'm saying? But y'all need to control y'all folk when they come over here jumping in the pit bull game, thinking they thinking because they got a couple of dollars or thinking because they get a, a nice pedigree, they can just talk talk all kind of ways to anybody. No, I especially ain't going to take nothing from somebody who can't even upkeep on a dog, can't even handle the upkeep on a dog. Come on, Buck. Buck City, all we asked you was three questions. One question with three answers last night. You couldn't answer that, but you want to get on my chat and say, Pelican Bay want to be like Buck City. Now I'm going to ask my brothers down in the chat, my sisters down in the chat, all the brothers and sisters watching this video, worldwide, nationwide, citywide, countrywide, woods wide, wherever you at. 
where in the hell would you get the picture, would you get or even figure that Pelican Bay is trying to move like Buck City? Buck City Kennels, the biggest dog bust since Michael Vick on social media, and he right here messing with everybody about their criminal charges, and he right, he he the only one got a, a criminal charges within the last six months that he ain't, he, like, he ain't do time for. Nobody care about no criminal stuff. We talking about dogs. If it's criminal stuff involving the dogs, yes. We're not talking about all that other stuff. You want to talk about all that, so you stay over there with them. You know? That's why you getting what you getting. And like I said last night, you know, like I said last night, it ain't my fault. I did what you want to do. Wanted to do, rather. You know what I'm saying? Did what you wanted to do. You know? You say, I, you say I'm a skinny, like I say. You say I'm a crackhead. It's all good. It's all good. But I have no mind. I have no mind, Elmer James. Thompson Kennel. I done told you what I'm going to do for you. I done told you what I'm going to do for you, Thompson Kennel, boy. Woo -hoo -hoo. And I don't care how old she is. No. Don't care how old she is. About to get my flirt game on, boy. Woo. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, man. Man, y'all boys. Yeah. Hey, I ain't gonna lie to you, man. I should have let Master of All Bulldogs in the, in the, up in there last night, y'all. Let y'all just roast it in his ass. You know, because he... Only thing about it, you know, he didn't deserve to be in that chat because I always gave him an opportunity to come. He don't want to come to start talking about his cousin Thompson Kennel. Two of the craziest dog men in South Carolina. Neither one of them. Well, see, y'all boys who got dogs from Thompson, I mean, it is what it is. Y'all ain't got nothing to do with this. But I'm going to say what I'm going to say about them dogs. You know what I'm saying? That ain't got nothing to do with y'all now. At the end of the day. You got your dogs from a fat, non-dog man from up north, front like he in the South Carolina area, like he know these parts of South Carolina, and he ain't going nowhere. He ain't moving all across South Carolina, going this place, that place. I ain't talking about with no dogs. I'm just talking about it in general. You know? But, hey, man, it is what it is, man. It is what it is. The entire time, Buck City worrying about J.D. Hall. He he worrying about J.D. Hall because he got the dog that Maul Cunt had over there and they got the age fucked up. It's bad when the man who sold the man the dog can't even have the age right. That's why I say, Maul Cunt, you better get your shit together, dog. We ain't playing that shit over here, you know, and we talking straight facts. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm tired of that copper shit. I back you when it come to that copper talk. I'm going to back, back it tonight because... Them brothers done, and what you got to do, Maul Cunt, is tell them brothers the truth. That ain't hog puppies. Them, them, them tricolor puppies, them not hog puppies. You see, brother brother, uh, brother Marcus, round my way. Brother Marcus, big salute to you, fam. You know what I'm saying? But you got to understand this. You got finesse, homie. You know? And this is what I'm trying to tell you like this right here. Them dogs you got, they look good, but them, not, them dogs not off hog, man. Something stuck them dogs while that man dog was on Maul Cunt Yard. And Maul Cunt don't want to validate that shit. But why Why you the only person in this whole country that got a dog that them colors is off hog? You, Brother Marcus, you got the same puppies that I've been making my videos about all this long time. Them same dogs got passed around until they got to you. And them dogs ain't off hog, man. You know, so don't even, you know, you got your papers. You know, they're going to say what they you know, say what they were going to say. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, dog, you need to holler at Maul Cunt. And y'all need to figure out who them dogs really, the dog's daddy really is. The, them tri dogs is not off hog. You know what I'm saying? I'm tired of hearing all that copper stuff. So that, okay, now if we go to the copper stuff, you know, show me a dog in copper pedigree that look like J.D. Hog. So now you're telling me J.D. Hogg not off the dog that's supposed to be Hogg. One or the other. J.D. Hogg must be off another dog that look like the Mayday stuff. You know? If he ain't off the one they call the Hogg, he must be off another one that look like the Mayday stuff. 
Because Copper don't got no dogs in his pedigree that look like J.D. Hall. Y'all keep talking about Copper for one litter of puppies. Y'all got that Copper rumor going around for one litter of puppies that Maul Cunt had that wouldn't come clean with that man bottle straight, hit that fucking man dog. Ain't no pit bull full. Let me show y'all brothers. Let me tell y'all brothers. Hold on, let me show you first. Red Boy, all Red Boy, Red Boy Jocko, we ain't talking about no black dogs in it, no thug, no thaw, no none of that shit. And it ain't coming out with no dog like this. Now, this is the reason a lot of them old school dog men, when they talk about y'all young brothers, they say y'all can't read pedigrees. Because when you see a dog like I just showed you, and then you say, oh, it could come off of them, them red boy and them yellow dogs and this and that. That can come off of that. You know what I'm saying? When I show that to them old schoolers, man, they laugh at that shit. Only y'all young brothers accept that. You know what I'm saying? That's why I say all my, my friends, the dog brothers, is, is 70 some years old and better. You know what I'm saying? I can't help it. I can't help it. You, you know who you know. I know who I know. You know what I'm saying? And the yellow boy, they done kicked me off. You know, they kicked me off for 24 hours for posting the truth. But like I said, you can't kick me off this real yellow boy. I want, we want our papers off that Alpo stuff. You know what I'm saying? We want our papers. Off that stuff. And Maul Cunt, you better straighten it out when it comes to that, that stuff that we gave you back off of them, uh, them hog puppies. You better straighten it out with your boy Buck City. I've been quiet for a long time. But you sitting there and playing the background while your boy out here doing this and doing that, and he, he probably lying to you like he got this shit under control. And he ain't told you I'm sitting out here with a, with, 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 I told you last night, with a stick, with a switch on it. You know what I'm saying? Hey, it just is what it is. Y'all boys better stop playing role. Tom Garner can't save you from this. You know, we need them papers, homie. That's all it is to it. You want me to stop saying about this, saying about that? Make it happen for us. Make it happen for us. If you ain't making it happen, we tired of talking. You know what I'm saying? You got your flunky out here screaming this, screaming that, throwing you under the bus. So, hey. I'm up under the bus already waiting. You ain't got to throw me up under the bus. I'm already, I'm, already, I'm already up under the waiting. You know what I'm saying? It just is what it is, man. You got Buck City out here trying to recruit J.D. Hall, Little Mates, and his offspring and all kind of shit, and his Little Mates offspring and all that. Come on, Buck. Get off our dick. You saying, I want to be like Buck City, but damn, let a brother breathe. You ain't got nothing to do with this, these dogs, these these old old family Southern Reds. You ain't got nothing to do with this stuff, buddy. These clean cut dogs, right here, clean cut. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. Like I told them boys, you ain't got to worry about getting no tricolor dogs off these hog dogs. You know what I'm saying? These yellow dogs, we ain't throwing off no tries. You know, stand on that, stand on it. Yeah, it is what it is, man. You know, if you just like the dog, then that's a different story. I like this. You know, I like that. No matter what his pedigree is, you know, speak the truth. If you like something, you're going to buy it no matter what the pedigree was. But to lie on something and try to make something what it is because you bought it. No, man, I'm going to tell you the truth. You know, you from the South, homie. You got finessed. They ain't shit you because they did give you product. You just ain't got what he thought you had. And you didn't get finesse because I've been making these videos and them dogs been known. Them dogs been known since they've been puppies. You know? So when they, when you gave it to you with the hog papers, you already knew which puppies them was. You figured I'm lying, don't know what I'm talking about, but you got finesse. You don't got no hog dogs. You got a dog that got hit by a damn stray. And the mama dog is a hog. And yeah, let me show you this right here. Now, big dog, that's your dog mama, your dog little. You know what I'm saying? Um, the, <laughs> hey, and guess what? We got your dog mama. We had your dog mama brother. And we done bred it so many times and never come out with a try. But you breed it back to the daddy and get a try. You know, and that's the only try little that your, your dog daddy had in all of America. All of America. 
Bread back to a red boy, though. Come on, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to be honest, though. Y'all boys got to stop that, man. Going to spend this money in these dogs. And then because you spend this money in these dogs, you want to go on the story that go along with it. But then you don't want to go on the truth because you done spent the money on it. Now, you, you just got to do the same thing. I tell you what you do. I tell you what you do, big dog. Big Marcus, call ADBA and start something right now. We about to start something tonight, buddy. We about to start something tonight. Call ADBA and ask them how in the hell these black dogs is coming off this pedigree. Call ADBA and ask them that shit. And if they tell you it's coming off that, I'm going to call them, big dog. I'm going to call them and I'm going to ask them myself. And I want to know, I want to see proof that you called them first. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to call them and ask them myself, and I'm going to say, it ain't no damn way in hell that these two dogs is coming off them dogs right there. You know? It ain't no way in hell. How did they register a litter of puppies that got black in these puppies when they doing background checks? And the color of this puppy say black and tan. And you see these dogs throwing off these dogs right here. How the hell you register them dogs up? Call ADBA Big Marcus. Call them. And if they tell you them, them dogs supposed to come off that, if they tell you it ain't no problem in that litter right there, then I'm going to call them and I'm going to put it on the air. We're going to do it live like we did it last time. You know what I'm saying? Because you can't fool some folk, but you ain't going to fool them old schoolers. You know what I'm saying? That's why I rock with Bonafide and them boys on a lot of stuff. You know what I'm saying? And, 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 and Miss Mims and them on a lot of stuff. You know, real doggers. You know what I'm saying? Real doggers that know that them kind of dogs don't belong in that picture. That shit went to slid on Miss Mims. Hell to the no. The red, them, them, them yellow dogs don't make dogs look like this. Son, you must have, son, I can hear Miss Mims now. Son, son must have got hold of that dog out there. I mean, I don't, I don't mean to be mean to you, but uh, they just don't come like this. I mean, she just going to be truthful with you, fam. You know? And y'all call ADBA with them papers because I know the ADBA registered. And, and please, Please, big dog, tell me they're not Tom Garner registered. Please tell me they're not registered with Tom Garner. Please tell me that, dog. These dogs ADBA registered, dog. Your dog's supposed to be ADBA registered like J.D. Hall. Call, a call ADBA tomorrow and ask them how in the hell this is a black dog, your dog black, coming off them dogs. All y'all scared to call and ask them people the deadly question. How is my dog black coming off these dogs and no black dogs coming off of? And tell me what ADBA tell you, and, I, and I'm going to get on it, big dog. I'm going to get on it. Until then, copper ain't got nothing to do with no hog, and your dog ain't off no copper, and you need to holler at mall cutting and figure out which one of them strays was on this damn yard or coyotes or whichever one. I ain't saying this a mix with no coyote. Another pit. Mall cut got them Sorrell's dogs over there. You know what I'm saying? Them black and brown dogs. He got them over there. You know, tell the man the truth. Man, there's enough lying and enough all that stuff, man. This man got the only, only litter of dogs off a of hog. Tricolor. And this man got tricolor, surreal color, all other color, bloodline, color, tri dogs on his yard. Tell the man the damn honest truth, man. Them dogs, like I showed y'all on the picture, yeah, the hog bred to him. If that's even hog, they said. Yeah, hog bred to him. But something else bred to them, too. You know what I'm saying? Something else bred to them, too. And that's all it is to it, man. I ain't going to stay on that too long because the the pudding, the, the proof is in the pudding when it comes to that, man. The proof is in the pudding. You know, all my, my brothers from back in the days, I'm going to ask y'all this. All my brothers from back in the days, you know, only one they ever, only one they ever scream and yell or call out is Jr. Jr. That's a Brindle, dog. I ain't talking about no Brindle. I'm talking about a Rockwaller color. You know what I'm saying? Tell me which one of them yellow dogs threw off a Rockwaller dog that didn't come off David Tant Yard. You know what I'm saying? We done fi figured out that he got the Rockwaller probably. He probably had them Rockwallers too. You know what I'm saying? Tell me any other yellow dogs that came off that Rock had Rockwaller offspring. And I'm, I'm going to be waiting for years because y'all ain't going to have it. You ain't going to find nothing when the rock wall is coming off that shit. Now, I'm trying to figure out, like I told y'all, I ain't in the swamps. 
You know what I'm saying? I, I'm, not, I'm not even in y'all boys' way. So, you know what I'm saying? Colt 45. See, when y'all see Colt 45, that's that's Tom, Tom, Thompson Kennel. These boys making fake pages to come in brothers' chats and, and talking about them on their page and, and, and making a fake page to go up in there and talk all kind of trash. That's why I tell y'all, man, I can't respect y'all, man. Y'all clowns, cornballs, man. Cornballs. You know what I'm saying? Bunch of semen recruits. You know? Bunch of semen recruits. Woke up early this morning talking about me. Talking about the bay. Buck said he come on there trying to record both channels. Man, you was a damn, I don't know what the hell wrong with you, dog. I don't know what's wrong with you, dog. But I ain't going to get caught up in it. You know what I'm saying? I'm just going to keep doing what I'm doing. Keeping that thing on your neck. You know what I'm saying? Keeping that thing on that neck. <laughs> and you keep pressing everybody about their damn charges and shit. And you the only one I hear with damn, you the only one I hear with damn open shit going on. Had open shit going on. You know what I'm saying? You know, and I curled all of them out last night. Made all of them jump the box. They ain't jump the box, brothers. In order to jump the box, you got to come to the box. They never came. Forfeit. Collect the bread. Something Thompson wouldn't know about. Hey, but it's all good, man. It's all good. Big shout out to brother Marcel Shepard, brother D-Man. Sorry for getting y'all caught up in that confusion last night. Temperatures were just rising, you know what I'm saying? And you had a, a F boy, you know, that was, you know, saying all kind of stuff out of his mouth. You know, that ain't correct. All we want to know is about Michael Myers. We can't get one thing about Michael Myers. All y'all brothers had to do all these years ago was ask about Michael Myers, and y'all wouldn't do it. That's all y'all had to do. Y'all couldn't get a simple answer. And Supreme Excellence. Man, the boys, hey, you 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 went you and did all that because Welsh gave you a dog. You know what I'm saying? You did all that because you got a dog from Welsh. Man, I would have gave you two dogs. You would have kept it solid. <laughs> hey, man, these boys out here dick jocking and jacking and all that for puppies. Man, listen here, man. Y'all boys got to keep it real. You going to see Supreme. You'll be, you be alone in a minute. They ain't going to be over there to help you, dog. You get in the chat and you talk about me. And if I get on your ass, right, and I just start bombing on you for the next week, then they ain't going to come to your, your rescue, fam. You know what I'm saying? They ain't going to come to you, dog. They ain't going to do it. When them boys start getting on you supreme in them other chats, see what Buck City them do. See if they come riding for you. You know what I'm saying? See if they come to help you. <laughs> they wouldn't help their damn self. You know what I'm saying? They wouldn't help themselves. Hey, but it is what it is, man. Big salute to all the bulldoggers out there with dog channels. You know what I'm saying? That's doing their things. You know, doing their things. I just had to make a couple things correct tonight, man. Make a couple things correct. And especially when it comes to that hog stuff. When it comes to J.D. Hog. When it comes to Buck City trying to buy J.D. Hog's siblings' offspring. You know what I'm saying? J.D. Hog's siblings. And then he got the nerve to come up there and try to, try to, shine on me try to correct me try to dis try to make me seem like i'm uh don't know what the hell going on or man let's hear man buck city man you slow sleep and left behind time man plus some tree huggers on your ass them tree tree huggers on your ass so you can't even stop moving you know what i'm saying like and, and then they say it's a video it's a, a news article out saying that the, the, the tree huggers know about the newest videos you dropping out you don't even care. Use a tree hugger's dream. They coming for your ass, boy. And them folk around you, it's just sad to say. How the hell are you doing this when them folk told you you got a lifetime ban in dogs? What are you trying to bring around us? You and Ram to walk them down, to, to walk them down Crip. Come around civilians, bringing all y'all heat. Walk them down Ram, he ain't going to hurt no, nobody. Bless his heart. You know what I'm saying? Bless his heart. You know, but it is what it is, man. You heard it from the Bay. Some gonna like it, some ain't, man. Supreme, man. Supreme. Don't base, don't base who you talk in this chat and who you talk good and bad on because of what a brother give you. You know what I'm saying? You just a bitch then. When I say it like that, a bitch that can be pimp. I give you a couple dollars, now you on my dick. You know what I'm saying? On my dick. Like I said before, I don't need yes men around me. That's worse than a yes man. Use a prostitute when you do stuff like that. 
You know what I'm saying? So get it together, big dog. You know, get it together. You know, get it together. And I want to send a salute to uh, uh, student of life, student of life, student for life, dogs. I'm going to send a salute to you again, dog, because you got you got up in the mix of things last night when it got heated and you said something. And I tried to correct it last night, but I'm corrected again. You know what I'm saying? No matter what we're talking about, when we're talking about that beefing and, and, and talking about all that other stuff and, and the crazy stuff when it comes to these dogs, you said one thing that caught my attention when you won the obedience challenge. You know what I'm saying? You won that obedience challenge. I stopped what I was what I was saying, and I say salute to you. You know what I'm saying? And and, and I, I gave you your props. You know, and I ain't gonna never not give you your props when you're doing something legal, legit, legitly, something right with these dogs, something great with these pit bulls. You know what I'm saying? So like I say, salute to you again. And uh, I had to say it like I had to cut it off because you know. Once I ain't talking about saluting you no more, you can get on my ass and I have, might have to get on your ass. You know what I'm saying? But when you're doing something good, I'm going to give you props, big dog. You know what I'm saying? Other than that, you, you talk shit sometimes and I'll get you right back. So it is what it is. You know, I know how you come. You, you are, I already know how you come. You know what I'm saying? But, hey, I was here to lay some things down, man. Uh, one thing we're going to do before we get up out of here, because, we got, like I said, we got some things to talk about. Let's do some comparing. Buck City. You know, you want to get up there and worry about J.D. and all that. So let's compare yards. I got two pictures. I got a picture of my yard, and I got a picture of your yard. Let's compare, and let's see what we're going to find. You know what I'm saying? First, you know, let me show y'all the picture of my yard. Now, that was a picture of my yard. Now you got a picture of Buck City, you know. Buck City. Now, you look through my whole yard. I don't know what they what what they, what they felt like it was worth cracking about. See, I had um um carrying crates, dog houses from Tractor Supply. You know what I'm saying? Dog houses from Tractor Supply, one barrel. You know, as well as um lifted off the ground. You know. But what we what, what we looking at on this yard is shit, 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 shit. You know, come on, man. You think I you think I want to hear something you got to say? Just like Chico say, man. You bottom of the barrel, Buck City. You scum. You bottom of the barrel, big dog. You'd have been all right if you'd have stayed in your place. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you bottom of the barrel, homie. Your fans, bottom of the barrel. Thompson, bottom of the barrel. But you really bottom of the barrel, Buck City. You know, you really bottom. Thompson, can, he can have dogs. You know, you can't have no dogs, and you out here pressing the issue. Calling call brothers skinny this and that, crackhead this and that, you know, all that. Like, hey, what that supposed to mean? You can say all that, but you still can't have no damn dogs. <laughs> hey, I get up here right I say, I tell you what, dare me, I go over there and get one of them yellow dogs right now, put it on camera. Show them folk with me with a nice, pretty dog right now. Dare me. I dare you, Buck City, since you want to know about J.D. Hall, I'll tell you everything you want to know about J.D. Hall. Whole record. His whole record. If you just show me that you got the nuts to get on that camera with a dog. Since you got so much nuts, you told the judge you're going to do what you want to do. Big dog. <laughs> Show us you got some nuts. And I'll give you J.D. Hawk record since Welsh can't tell us Bane record. Welsh can't tell us Bane record. And Thompson can't tell us the, the parts of the keep. And now he on the next next man page talking about, I ain't never said I did nothing. I ain't never said I did nothing. Man, shut the hell up, Thompson. Come on, man. Come on. All I know is you got a bunch of that fake shit that you was pumping in Young Bucks. You know, fake stuff. You're right, I don't run that ball stuff. No disrespect to the ball stuff. We got a different thing we running on this side of town, man. And poor old Welsh, poor old Welsh, he just lost in the sauce, man. He just lost in the sauce. He'll be all right, though, man. He'll be all right, you know. At the end of the day, like I said, 
Your boy Buck City, he admired JD. He like him. Instead of saying he like him, he going to try to get puppies and offspring off of JD brother. They got JD's sister already. You know what I'm saying? So they trying to put something together to make that same stuff like JD, but they can't do it. All right, man. At the end of the day, what we have here is a bunch of brothers who won't answer the simple questions. Michael Myers, just give us Michael Myers' record, man. What did Michael Myers do? How did Michael Myers, what, you know, talk, you can't talk about Michael Myers? Why you worrying about JD? JD Ho. That's out your, that's out your price range, big homie. You know, big bucks. You say you got big bucks, right? You ain't got enough bucks. Your bucks won't get you that. You know, but it is what it is, man. PBK nines, them puppies starting to roll, them puppies starting to move. I got to get to it, man. Buck City, I got to go holler at my dogs, man. <laughs> holler at me when you can have some. You know what I'm saying? At least when you got nuts to come on the camera with some. Hold up, man. Hold up, man. Hold up. Let me show you a little JD, man. Little JD right here. You worrying about big JD. You worrying about big JD 11 months. Say something, man. You worrying about big JD to he 11 months <laughs> and little JD coming out. Ah, man, it's, it's all good, though, man. It's all good. I, I, like I said, I know why y'all boys be hating, man. I know why you be hating. Hey, I hate too, man. I hate too. You know, it just is what it is. You know, PDK nines, I give it to you the way I always give it to you, man. I give it to you. Raw and uncut, fair and unbiased. You know what I'm saying? Bulldog City, Bulldog Capital. I told y'all we got that yellow stuff in the sand over here, man. I told y'all them yellow dogs is in the sand over here. You know what I'm saying? And brother, uh, brother Marcus, this is what a hog dog, bred off hog look like. You know what I'm saying? No disrespect. But they don't come in black and tricolor, big dog. You know what I'm saying? They don't come in that color. You know, they don't do it. Y'all stay safe. Y'all stay legal. PBK nines. Hold up, man. Hold up, man. Let me stunt on this fool tonight, man. Let me stunt real quick, man. Hold up. I got to stunt on him. Let's do some stunt in the night. Let's do some stunt in the night. Yeah. Let's do some stunt tonight, man. Got little Marino here. Ain't that right, Bubba? Got little Marino here. Ain't that right, Bubba? Yeah. His ears standing up now. They standing up a little bit. They down now because I got them in my hand. But yeah, man, PBK nines. And I'm out.